The warm-up is one of the most important concepts of sport. Uh, every sport has it, and we want to make sure in our camps that we implement it and teach the kids proper fundamentals of how to stretch, dynamic stretching, static stretching, um, and how to warm up correctly. The first part of our camp is always a dynamic warm-up, whether it be with cones, whether it be with ladders, moving the feet, working on skills, and having a little bit of fun with it. In the warm-up, we instruct on footwork, whether it be how to move the feet around a cone as fast as they can to improve footwork and improve speed and improve reaction time, or how to correctly perform a sports-specific skill like a scissor move or a step-over move. We also obviously want to help the kids with, with speed and footwork and moving side to side. Uh, lateral movement in front of a cone uh, is really important. In the warm-up, we also try to incorporate skills. Whether it be a coach throwing a ball to work on heading technique, or a coach throwing a ball to work on chest trapping. We definitely try to incorporate skills. We want to add some fun component to the warm-up so that they look at it as being something that they can look forward to before practice or before a game or before a camp. It might be diving headers or, or it might be incorporating a uh, challenge competition on the best celebration. Uh, we always want to make sure that the kids have a good time. And so the second component of our warm-up is a static type of warm-up on the cone with the ball. Repetitively working with the ball to improve technique. Whether it be step-overs, whether it be scissors, which we consider to be called unders, um, and continuous, continuously making sure that the kids have as many touches, as many repetitive movements as possible to improve mechanics of sport, which we feel in turn uh, improves overall ability.